Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to properly create a survey widget or element for your website on WordPress using the Elementor plugin. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first thing that we want to make sure of is that we're logged into our WordPress account as an administrator. And it goes without saying that you guys want to make sure that you have the Elementor plugin installed like I do here. So I have the site builder and the text editor open as you can see. So the idea here if, is if I want to add a survey that's already custom made for my website, I would go to this website right here. So elfsite.com. So in a nutshell, Elfsite is actually a, a widget builder that contains a lot of um, uh, different elements that you can add to your WordPress site or your site builder. And among them is the survey form. So we're going to, the idea here is we're going to be signing up for an account, as you can see. So we're gonna sign up for free and we're going to continue with either um, your Facebook account or Google. That's really up to you. So if I were to choose Google, um, I'm not sure if you guys can see, but a new window pops up. Um, yeah, a, a new window for Google asking you to log in. So let's just do that. Uh, let's just do this one. Let me choose an email that I want tied to the Elfsite account. Give it permission, authorize it to connect and integrate with um, your Google account. And right away, you'll see here that this is what the dashboard for Elfsite looks like. Now, if we were to add a template for uh, surveys, we would want to click on home. So catalog home, as you can see here, so let's do forms, the survey here. Okay, survey is not here. Or we could do like a quick search for survey. So here we are. I guess this one, uh, I guess this one uh, will do. So when we click on form builder, we're going to be choosing a template and right away, you'll see that there's an option for survey. So we're going to be choosing this one. And here you get to configure uh, what you want it to say. So you can have it um, say something else, like for the application forms or whatever. And you can have it, um, you can have it, uh, have a star rating system for it, as well as a comment box and whatever. So if we continue with the template, you can edit the elements like the header the progress bar, the buttons, and whatever. So I'm just going to leave it as is, as it's pretty much the same deal. So when we click on publish, you'll see that it's going to ask you to uh, pay for, or I should say, um, give you an option for uh, their entire package so you get to use their services. But in this case, I just need the one survey, so we're going to go with the free plan. We're going to click on select, and then you'll see that this is what we are looking for. So this embed code right here. So when we go to copy the code, just like that, we're going to head back to the site editor. And if I were to add a new widget somewhere, let's say that I want to edit this one. Where's the HTML? Okay, let's actually, you know what? Let's do this one instead. So this is the site editor. So if I want to add a text here, I mean, or I should say a survey, I, I would go back from, let's actually go back from the start here. Uh, so like to container, site settings, elements, here we are. So if I were to type down HTML, you want to click on this widget here. You want to drag it along somewhere here. So you know what, let's do it here in between uh, the header as well as the uh, text. So, okay, so this one is an HTML bar. Now, if I were to add the code here, like I said, you want to copy this and you want to insert the code right here. Now let's actually wait for it. And there you guys go. You now have a survey for your website on WordPress. So here, oh, let's actually undo. Oh, so here we are. And all you guys have to do is simply uh, save changes and you're done. So yeah, that's the video. So hopefully it helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So yeah, thank you all for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.